And a warm welcome on what is an ideal night for football, you've got to say. I'm Derek Ray, here on the commentary position, joined by Lee Dixon to help me describe all the action. We're moving towards the business end of the UEFA Europa League. We're now in the round of 32. It is Feyenoord up against Manchester United. Well, can he make this move count? So the initial 11 for the home side. If you like wingers, you'll love this league. Yeah, absolutely. I love to watch a winger play, especially with pace and power. The central strike will stay more or less in... Kane! And the keeper had to react in an instant. Oh, and does he? Wow, does he react? What a save that is. And that's a deep corner. A brisk start and a quick goal. Well, the manager would have said, keep it tight at the back and see if we can nick an early goal. And they certainly have done. Well, we're going to see the replay here. You can't head the ball in the net if you don't get any crosses in. The crosses are coming in thick and fast. And that was a beauty. That made the goal. So back underway in this game, Manchester United with the advantage. Luciano Narsic. Dario Lescano. Trying his luck from long. And a wild, wild attempt from long range. Not one for his highlight reel. Well, it's a poor choice. He's got other options on. Why is he shooting from that distance? Juan Bisaka. De Bruyne now. Well, regaining possession for his side, cleverly. Now Hiroki Sakai. In possession, fair. And they are on the move again. And he's made headway. Does he have the beating of the goalkeeper? Well, another wonderful save to add to his portfolio. Well, they're still behind, Derek, aren't they? But how? What incredible goalkeeping that was. And Jaden Sancho. And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. And United have the corner. He's driven in the corner. Oh, he's missed the chance to extend their advantage. Oh, a golden opportunity to really put the game to bed. He might be able to profit from the wide position. Well, let's see what he has in store for them. Bruno Fernandes has it. There's a slide rule pass. And options in the centre. Not problematic for the keeper. Dario Lescano. In possession, fair. 
carrying it and he's broken free can he beat the goalkeeper and given away now what can he do here is he going to punish them here easy save for David De Gea Narsing Dario Lescano Will there be a tangible end product? And on the volley, that's not exactly how he intended to catch it. Well, it's worth a chance. One in ten, it goes in the top corner. Nine out of ten, goes where it did do. This is Varane. And now this is Longley. Given away by Manchester United. Can they cut up in the defence with a through ball? And it was blocked, that particular cross. Jaden Sancho and Kane prepared to fire rifled against the post but back in play not far away at all with the volley well to catch it like that you've got a really good technique and oh so close Leroy Fair and on the ball Botigin. We've been waiting to find out, now we know. Oh, he's really opened them up here. Well, great read there to intercept. And the flag has gone up here, offside the decision. Bruno Fernandes has it. And with that, the first... <laughs> and the second half commences with Manchester United on top. Bruno Fernandes. It's with Alex Tennis. He had the sixth sense to know what to do and win it back. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? And an example of a counter-attack that went nowhere. Throw-ins given. He's been the standout for his side so far, don't you think, Lee? Well, Derek, it certainly was a good 45 minutes from the lad. Obviously got the goal to give him the lead, but he's looked very, very lively as well. Well, he failed to get it away properly. Easy save for David De Gea. Sancho now. An authoritative challenge. Just wanted to get it out of there. Bruno Fernandes. Well, he's opened up the defence here. Marcus Rashford. He knows what he's doing when it comes to blocking. And it's a quality pass. Not to be this time. De Bruyne now. And we're inside the final 30 minutes. Gorgeous pass from Rashford. In possession, fair. Marcus Rashford. Dario Lescano. De Bruyne dispossessed. Now well, let's see, does he mean business? Well, can he make this move count? Rashford, fine pass. Well, it's come down to the final 20 minutes here.
Now, what can he do here? Given away. Well, it's a poor tackle. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. Ready, and now they will make the personnel change. He has time to play it over. Will there be a tangible end product? Easy save for David De Gea. It's with McTominay. And now it's with Marcus Rashford. And a good-looking ball. And the ball is in the net. The crowd have gone crazy, and quite rightly so. What a finish that is. Well, let's look at this again. We've all hit these in training. First time, bang in the back of the net. Look at the calmness of it. Technique, brilliant. Well, a second goal for them here. In possession, fair. And on the ball, Botteguin. Giving the ball to the opposition that time. Scott McTominay. Jaden Sancho. In possession, fair. With their noses in front in the second half. What will be the thinking in the camp, Lee Dixon? Well, all the United players will be looking up at the clock. Time is ebbing away. They have such a delicate lead. Will they rue those missed chances? They could be costly. We might still be able to do a bit of damage. Is he going to punish them here? Real chance. Keeper did his job to begin with. Well, Derek, we've just seen... And so it is, full-time, the referee's whistle. An advantageous situation for Man...
two great clubs in one great city. It's Manchester, it's City against United, it's live for you on EA TV, coming up now. Welcome to you all, welcome to East Manchester, the Etihad Stadium, the home of Manchester City. And it's a special place to be today because Manchester United have made the short journey to take on City. Yeah, it takes over the City. They've been talking about this one all week and uh, you hope it won't disappoint out on that pitch for the next 90 minutes. I don't think it will. Number 14, Anelik Laporte. Number 28, Jordi Alba. Number 26, Axel Bietzel. Thank you for attending. Ready to go now for this Manchester derby. Manchester City's lineup today. Nicholas Sule starts with Imeric Laporte as the centre backs. Only one up front in terms of an out and out forward. This is then the Manchester United lineup. David De Gea starts in goal. Kevin De Bruyne plays with Bruno Fernandes in midfield. And a partnership with these two strikers up front. Opportunity in a wider area. Oh, that's good defending. Sancho. And he can take possession in his own half. Rashford with the ball now. Takes off the shot. And the referee spotted that deflection. He's pointed to the corner. Corner played in a problem until the clearance was made Bruno Fernandes is with De Bruyne has a go here it's come off the goalkeeper still in play bit of pressure on the player that's why it's gone out well had it not been for this keeper being on his toes they'd be one down by now really good stop That's an easy cut-out for the opposition, saw the pass coming. Bruno Fernandes, definitely a throw in there. Well, it's been a tough nut to crack, hasn't it, Manchester United this season? No, I think uh, the home side will have to produce something special. And a goal! That's a good block. Strong, powerful clearance. Rashford played it really without looking but got it in quickly straightforward save for Edison Sancho maybe he'll cross it here and now the shot United's corner well they've created chance after chance we need some ruthlessness now Swung in from the corner, and they get it away. Out for another corner. Kevin De Bruyne, well, for the next couple of hours or so, he's got to forget friendships and try and outwit his former team. Yeah, well, they know all about him, and they know what a good player he is, so they'll be guarded. He's put in the corner. Played away, well away from goal. It's De Bruyne. Poor attempt at a pass, really. Axel Witzel. Manchester United have won the ball back here. They could pose some danger now. Trying to get behind the defenders to get in a good cross. I think the opposition looked as though they believed they'd get through them, but they haven't. And now they can get on the ball and play. De Bruyne. He'll need to try and get the ball back now. Okay. Maybe just missed, kicked it a little bit there, and pass goes straight to the opposition. Can find some space here on the flanks. Supporting player alongside. Just read the intentions of the opposition there to make the interception. He got there just in time. In the end, a fantastic clearance. Well, they're having to defend, aren't they? So he's come deep and he's got hold of the ball and they can build off him.
Manchester United haven't made with great vision here just lost their way at the crucial moment of that counter-attack and they've lost the ball so we'll restart with a throw in and that will be another throw here here's Sterling able to cut that out with um, some sharp movement Rashford now the possibility for a cross shot up Charged down. Thought they were in to score there. Now this is an interesting attack. Chance to put it in the box from here. Two minutes of added time. Just a mistake, really. He's not even asked too much of the opponent. It's just a mishit pass. So it's half-time and we're still waiting for that first goal. And here come Manchester United right at the start of the second half. Certainly wanting to find a teammate, but he's just found an opponent. He's got some room out here in the wide position. Oh, it's close, Alan. Offside is given. He's quick enough. He doesn't need to do that. Great interception. Pass the ball a bit better than this if they're going to make progress, giving it straight away. Manchester City going to make a change here. And it's gone out for a throw. Well, this is the time where the managers really earn their money. It's going to be an alteration to try and improve the team. Now Marcus Rashford. Brilliantly read and much needed in that position to intervene. a little nudge to nudge you in the direction of what's coming up on EA Sports for you our coverage of the Premier League fixture Manchester City they'll be facing Derby County yeah really looking forward to this one uh, I think we're going to see some good football it's unlike him really to play the ball straight to the opposition trying to steer it through and he goes at the feet of the attacker well the attacker will feel that's a chance wasted that but uh, you've got to give full marks to the keeper well suddenly they could be on the counter-attack after this the visit steered through needs to stay cool now He's gonna try his luck it comes out off the goalkeeper the new player in at inter you heard it first with us the signing is complete well, he'll certainly be happy with it. And I think maybe the buying club will too, because £40 million, pounds, around that figure anyway, seems uh, a reasonable price for somebody of his quality. Now Marcus Rashford. A bit predictable with the passing and the opposition able to deal with that. Good vision here. That's good support play. And shoots! Still a chance in there off the goalkeeper. Couldn't keep it in play, it's gone out for a throw. The opportunity to change the tactics as well as the players with some movement from the bench. Number six, Nathan That's a wasted throw, he's given it straight to the opposition. So we'll restart with a throw in. Joao Cancelo. And here's Paul Pogba. On to Johnny Alba. He'll take the lead. They're desperate to try and 
change this game. It's been level, and now they're pushing on, looking for the goal that will take them in front. Now the countdown is to 10 minutes left. Trying to get the ball in behind. Whipped in from the wide area. It's not really away from... Space to try and hit it now. It's still level in the game, largely thanks to this fellow, the keeper. Oh, he's had a blinder. Whatever they try, they're really struggling to get one past him. Nil-nil in this nail-biting match with five minutes to go. Chance for the cross. Switch of emphasis going inside. The shot's on! Saw the pass coming and got there first. Just read the intentions of the opposition there to make the interception. Two more minutes to be played, probing the pass. Harry Kane onside. Very good stop here. There was another corner for the opposition to defend against Manchester United. We'll be looking to decide the game from it. Corner's taken. Defended well. Trying to pick out someone in the centre. Good defensive clearance there. It's finished level here at the final whistle. Well, it's so often... It is time for the match. Martin Tyler here to describe it for you with my good friend Alan Smith. Yeah, hi there, Martin. Walking into the ground today, I just got that feeling. Feeling it's going to be a really good afternoon. Our match today is Wolverhampton Wanderers versus Manchester United. And here is the way Wolves are set out for this vital fixture. Well, we put it up as a 5-2-3. It could be... 3-4-3, three, three, couldn't it, if the wide players get forward from the back? Yeah, I think it's one of those, it could be anything the manager wants it to be. He has got some very talented lads out there, though. And the opposing team will start the game like this. And they're going to have to restart with a throw. Delivered into the box. Rodded back across goal, just too high, just over with the header. Yeah, nice firm connection, unlucky. That's a brilliant challenge. Well, the visiting manager will know all the scenarios here. Steered through, Kane. And there's the cutback, right from the kickoff. They look like scoring they have now. Sharp from the off, and what a good goal. And he's not hit it with power, has he? But he's certainly hit it with accuracy. In front here are Manchester United. Then Donker. Read by the defender. 
and they're looking good when they get the ball out wide as they've done here okay trying to get the ball trying to thread a pass through but not successful That's an easy interception. The pass wasn't really a very thoughtful one. He's got the technique to deal with the press. Maybe just missed, kicked it a little bit there and pass goes straight to the opposition. Jimenez could get the ball into the box now. Pulls it back now. And now will have a goal kick. Guided through. Well, the play is broken down now. He's got it away. A chance to break away now on the counter. Jimenez. It's a weak cross, really. Not getting past the first defender. Put in from the wide area. Oh, that's good defending. Well, half-time approaching. Threading it through. Disappointed that that didn't lead to more. That's great defending there, stopping that attack. Okay. Oh, he blocked it then. Here they are, the Manchester United fans hoping that this is a prelude for better things. They have got the lead, they haven't been at their very best. But of course they're capable of upping a gear. On the move, slipping it through. Jimenez. Superb from De Gea. It will be a corner. Well, those fans haven't seen the ball up this end for ages, it seems. The chance here, though, good delivery into the box. Chance for an equaliser. Cleared away, well away from goal. Jimenez. That's an excellent cross. And we've got two added minutes. That's been signal now. Two minutes of added time. So it's one nil here as the half-time whistle goes. Looking good for Manchester United in the first half at least. We'll see what they do in the second half now. Rashford with the ball now. Well, he has got a chance to get the cross in. Defence not really stretched by that cross, and they get the ball away. Strong challenge. He's got his shot off now. Just a mistake, really. He's not even asked too much of the opponent. It's just a mishit pass. Four on the ball. The home team about to make a change. Poor attempt at a pass, really. The pass threaded through. Well, he has cleared the danger. I think that's a good performance, isn't it, Alan, from him in the first half? Yeah, it was a good first 45 minutes from the lad. Got the ball rolling with that goal, and he's been central to most of the good things his team has done. Well, coming up for you on EA Sports, the next Premier League fixture for the hosts. Well, that's over the top of the defender, and one to chase. Brilliant pass, can he finish it? Shots on here. 
Oh, nowhere near. No, he's miscued that one. He's cued it badly. It's a tactical substitution for the losing team here. They just lost the ball, United. Here's a chance to go down the outside of the opposition. And now the shot! Simple save for David De Gea. He's got it away. Here's Hoybjerg. He's given it straight to the opposition. What about Manchester United's next game, Alan? They're playing Leicester City in their next match. So much at stake, and I think it will be tense and tight. And it's a shot now! Good work by the goalkeeper. Napoli have got their man today. That deal has gone through. Yeah, it's a fairly big transfer, isn't it? We're here about £25 million, pounds, and I think this player is worth that figure, though. OK, could whip it in from here. It's a good cross. Time ticking on. Just over 15 minutes to go. Oh, that doesn't look too good. Probably a pulled muscle. Jimenez. Oh, listen to the atmosphere in here. Fans doing their bit to spur their team on for this equaliser. Bit of space to go forward into with the ball. To get the equaliser. Oh, they've got their equaliser. That's the very least they deserve from this game. Time ticking away from them. But they've found a way. They've dominated the play. They've had so much of the ball. But the opposition been defending gallantly but that resistance has finally been broken we've got 10 minutes left on the clock can find some space here on the flanks Rashford now the possibility for a cross I think the opposition looked as though they believed they'd get through them but they haven't and now they can get on the ball and play This is going to be a throw. Here's Hoybjerg. Oh, they thought they were in for the winner there until that marvellous interception. The Not going to ball. There'll be two added minutes. Two minutes. Oh, we could be in. And the shot go! United take the lead! And will we see a response? Well, this is incredible. They've surely won the match with this goal. The last kick of the match. Well, it's great for the striker. Just when the pressure's on, when it's begging out for somebody to make themselves a hero, he's done that. We had seemed to be stuck in a, a bit of a stalemate, in truth. But this very, very late goal has changed... The well, there's the final whistle, and it's a win here for Manchester United. Well, they got there in the end. Mike. If you want to know something about me, the blood in my veins is full of northern grey. I got that northern soul, man, I got the way. We're far from ordinary people. And if you want to know something about us, the hearts in our chest are full of northern love. And even when we broke, we'll always have enough. We're far from ordinary people. Yeah. We're far yeah. from ordinary people. Right, how can I say this? I'm more pleased with no one expects us to make it There was the stone roses and oasis But when they were big we were still babies I'm talking to the new generation And we wasn't born in the 80s They say that we don't see many places Cause nobody's left there for ages Serious love for the people that raised us Even though it got crazy Poverty stricken but that never fazed us Not one of us lazy And I'll be the first to say money don't change us Well it did change me I'll never forget 
where I came from, that's just, it's the struggle that saved me. On the streets we got brought up, we play on the grass, we're trying to be pro footballers. They say there's no kings out here, nobody's got money, every one of us poor. I beg to differ, cause I see the bigger picture. Every one of us kings, we can live on the street and make it a castle. What they call us, they can keep throwing out all us. In fact, bring cameras and record us. We've been fighting for survival, and you're gonna lose. Well, the wait is almost over. We are down to the last game of this terrific competition. Two extremely good teams will go head to head for the trophy itself. Moments away from the kickoff, and we're live. Big welcome to you all for a very big game. It is the final of the Carabao Cup, the English League Cup and going for silverware, two fine teams. I'm Martin Tyler, with me is Alan Smith. Well, a strong character in the Manchester United lineup, and a strong competitor as well. Well, he's one of the best finishers around, without question. You look at his goal ratio down the years, and impressive to say the least. This is then the Manchester United lineup. David De Gea starts in goal, Kevin De Bruyne plays with Bruno Fernandes in midfield, and it looks good in attack with these two strikers. This is the Leicester City lineup. Well, we've gone with a 4-3-3 formation here for them. Is that the way you see it, Alan? Yeah, I mean, it can be adjusted. It could almost be a 4-5-1 if they decide to come over all defensive, this team. But uh, if they're on the front foot, that three up front can cause the opposition back four some problems. Good forward play from them. For sure, is a goal kick. <laughs> quick witted and quick in his movement, too, to intercept the. Hey! Manchester United have won a corner. Put the corner in the middle. Wonderful reflexes to make the save from close range. Out for another corner. Well, here comes the corner. It's a brave effort, really, in amongst the players to get the header in, but off target, way off target. Yeah, not his best effort, that's for sure. We get to see, of course, the assistants don't. Whether that'll change down the years, uh, I'm not sure. But anyway, the replay here shows he's got it right. He has. I mean, there was no real goal-scoring chance, but uh, the defence would be pleased that uh, their organisation caught him off. Telemans. Really strong tackle, and the ball's gone out for a throw. coming up just read the intentions of the opposition there to make the interception Fernandez guiding it through it's broken down and they'll have to try again That's a good spot by the defender. Lovely ball. Brilliant pass, can he finish it? Rashford, it's about a try one now. Well, here it is, the first goal of the game that they've absolutely dominated. Very good play. Defence opened up again, but the difference is this time that they put the ball past the goalkeeper. Good finish, and they're looking a very classy side at the moment. The side that has the form, and indeed you would think the better players, 
are doing well at the moment. They've got a goal and they're beginning to boss proceedings. Yeah, they're moving the ball about better, Martin. Certainly getting good delivery in from those wide areas. The much stronger side. In front here are Manchester United. Spage. Ricardo Pereira. Tielemans. Now here's a chance to get at the opposition. Certainly wanting to find a teammate, but he's just found an opponent. A chance to break away now on the counter. Defended well. I think uh, any football fan will say when the rain comes down like it's coming down now, it's going to add to the thrills of a few spills, possibly. Well, it normally does, doesn't it? And I always used to like it because uh, it quite often meant you got a few more chances in the box with the uh, bounce of the ball and what have you. Here's Harry Kane. Here they are, the Manchester United fans, hoping that this is a prelude for better things. They have got the lead, they haven't been at their very best. Guiding it through the defenders. Trying to pick out someone in the centre. Far too close across to the keeper. On it back with an interception. Thielemann slipping it through. Great start by David De Gea. Look for all the world as if he would be beaten there. Corner coming up. Corner swung in. Out in front of goal. Manchester United with the ball again. Well, they're leading at half-time in the English League Cup final, but they would be full. So the English League Cup final has had its first half. Here goes the second half. We're underway. Yeah, it could be draining this pitch and going into the second half, further into it, maybe tiredness will play a part. Manchester United have won the ball back here. Getting forward well as a team now. It's a good cross. Well, it was a cross that he got in quickly, but he didn't really control. Well, that is a cheap piece of play to give the ball away like that. Opportunity, and it's a shot now. Well, that's gone behind for a corner. Swung in from the corner. Well, it's come to nothing in the end. Anticipated the direction of the pass and was able to intervene. Telemans. He's got his shot off now. Simple save for David De Gea. featuring here has done well he's certainly been an influence on this first half well he played really well didn't he and he got himself a goal to put his team ahead he'll be pleased with that first 45 minutes and the goalkeeper will get this one no problem quick note for your diary make a note of this particular date EA Sports we've got the presentation of the Premier League fixture it comes up for Leicester City. Leicester City facing Manchester United away from home. Yeah, it's got a good feel about it, that one. Look forward to joining you in the gantry for it. Ines Belanda. This is an exercise in patience as they try to get an opening. Leicester looking to get the ball up the other end of the field quickly. It looks like the opposition is in for an aerial bombardment here. Judging by the way, the centre-halves are going forward. We've given it straight to the opposition. Well, here's an opportunity with the ball over the top. Got to be. And that will be a corner. The referee has given a corner here. 
Number 17, Mayers Pierre. To the corner played in. It's broken down. They'll have to try again. Well, here comes the support. Going forward well. Oh, he's won the ball in his own penalty area. Got to deal with it now. Don't want to be caught betwixt and between here, Manchester United. Just inviting pressure as they defend this lead. Well, history tells you that they don't normally sit back, but this is a slightly different United side. Well, maybe the counter-attack is on here. Mark Albright. And this could bring them level. They were celebrating the equaliser, but the goalkeeper had other ideas. Yeah, it really should have been all level now, shouldn't it? And the more you look at the replays, the better this save was. If they do win, Manchester United will have thoroughly deserved it, and they should win from this position. The shot's off! Really close, great technique there. Oh, there's no finer sight than when you get that right. Unlucky. Alex Telles. Substitution imminent now. That goes to David De Gea. There's only a minute to go. That's the referee's decision. Two added minutes. Two minutes. Still going, Leicester City. They certainly haven't packed it in. Only partially away from danger. The safe hands from the goalkeeper there. Not the most. Well, there is the final whistle, and that confirms what we've been knowing for some time: that they are the champions. Alan. Yeah, absolute joy amongst those players they've worked long and hard haven't they, over the course of the last nine months or so and boy they deserve it these are special moments for a very successful team congratulations to them wonderful scenes of joy here and no wonder they're milking the moment to make absolutely the most of this. Well, they're a tougher team, aren't they? They stuck together, defended really well in this competition and snatched the goals at the uh, vital time. So, fully deserved winners. There they go. They are the champions. It's all part of a very special day, this, isn't it? To go and share the moment with the supporters. Yeah, and I know the family up in the stands too. It's one of those days you do not forget in a hurry. Brilliant scenes here. You have to have the team photo. And they're getting ready for it now. Yeah, one of those lovely scenes that you'll hang on the wall back at home. 